Hey, what's up guys and welcome to today's video and today I'm taking you through a day in a life during this quarantine lockdown and uh, showing you how I stay productive and a few of my day tasks. Now, sit back, relax and enjoy the video. Things are pretty simple in the morning. We wake up, I think it's, uh, it's actually late for us today. It's 7.20, not sure if you can see that. Usually we wake up around six, but had a long day yesterday. Pretty productive, but it went to bed a bit later than usual. Uh, and then we go downstairs. After we drink our coffee, uh, we usually just sit here for a little bit, catch up because it's been it's been eight hours since we've seen each other, so obviously lots of uh, lots to talk about. Um, and then we let the caffeine kick in and uh, make some breakfast. So that's my breakfast. To be honest with you, I've only recently gone into like a low carb breakfast just because I want to save more of my carbs for the evening because uh, we're doing I don't really do like bulking or cutting but this quarantine has warranted a lot of snacks so I'm trying to you know forego the carbs in the morning because I know I'll start snacking in the evening um, so yeah I'm less hungry then so yeah we're gonna eat this sit sit back for a little bit and then we're gonna go upstairs to the office coming up the stairs and I want you guys to excuse my hair it's early in the morning I haven't done it yet so going into the office we probably one of the best things oh so bright one of the most important things you can do especially now while we're in quarantine um to, what, are you, what are you eating quarantine post look at look 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 at it show me show me it's 8 a.m she's eating snowballs <laughs> Anyway, here you go. <laughs> anyway, as I was saying, the most important thing I think for anyone to do, especially when you're stuck at home in quarantine, I think, I think you should do this anyway, it doesn't matter if you're in quarantine, is to plan your day. Can you see that? Yes. This is a list of things we've got to do, just in general at the moment, and we've got another whiteboard for the day's tasks, and we're gonna fill this out now. Um, and you don't need a whiteboard, you can do it on your phone. Uh, I'd recommend just going into your notes, Listing down the things you need to do that day and ticking them off because that will be so crucial Especially now to have you get a sense of Accomplishment, you know feeling that you've actually done something with your day, especially when you're stuck at home So we're gonna plan our day now and then get to work on some emails. So after we planned our day hair is still a mess uh, We come over to the supplement cupboard and we like ration out our supplements. Have a look at this today We organized it. We've got stimulants and amino acids Vitamins, that's first aid, we don't need that one. And we got digestive enzymes and oil. So we're going to uh, start portioning this out. Most, it's all from my protein, guys. You can all get this stuff. Um, but I gen to ha generally have all my stuff after uh, breakfast, and I'll show you what I have. So, got all the supplements here. It's quite a lot of supplements, but it's I take them all in one go. I don't like spread them throughout the day. It's just like. Actually, I'll list them on the screen here because I don't want to talk. I'll be here all day trying to list them out. Um, and I just washed it down with some creatine. Uh, but that's pretty much our morning. Um, it's currently quarter to nine. Usually we're an hour behind, so we actually woke up an hour later today, but um, we just needed a rest, went to bed late, I had a busy day yesterday. Um, but yeah, we're gonna sit on the laptop now. I'm gonna work on some emails, get some edits done, and we'll see you uh, probably either at lunch or when we're about to train. So, we'll see you there. All right guys, so after we've done in the office, replied to emails, we're gonna come down for our pre-workout meal. Um, and as you can tell, my hair is awful, as you guys probably feel the same way. So, the solution, I had to put that on. Problem solved. Bad hair, who cares? Um, but I will actually have a video coming up soon in us doing 
my hair i've teamed up with a company and we will be showing you how to actually trim it uh, i'm going to be learning more from my uh on my ig story i'm going to be doing a live with a hairstylist but that's all coming soon but if you haven't followed me on instagram um go check me out i do videos i do posts and yeah let's uh let's make some lunch well pre-workout meals too early for lunch isn't it yeah Ah, uh, and after that little sketch, we have the pre-workout meal. Um, it's oats uh, with protein and some cinnamon and cashew butter there. I'm eating out of the pan to save uh, space in the dishes because I am a man who likes to think and Domi's got the uh, crackers of power. Um, this is the pre-workout meal. We're going to let it digest for about an hour, hour and a half, and then we're going to go train. Hold on, yeah. So, so now we have uh, let that food digest. We've come up, we've done a bit more work in uh, the office. I'm so proud about this office. You know, it just makes makes me happy. I always feel like if you have a good workspace, good work environment, you're able to be so much more productive because you're actually enjoying the space that you're in. But anyway, that's enough about the office. I'll give some you know, tips about, uh, I'll be quiet. Anyway, got ourselves a rain for pre-workout. Um, I'm really liking these. I'm trying to stay away from pre-workouts. I know you're thinking, why are you going to <laughs> energy drinks? It's not like they're much better. But this actually has uh, natural caffeine from coffee beans uh, and green tea extract rather than dehydrated caffeine that is in your uh, pre-workouts. So just taking a bit of time off from synthetic caffeine and going with the natural caffeine is a you don't get as jittery and you feel a lot better. So having this and then we're going to go hit a big leg day in our home gym. I'll show a few of the exercises and in three, two, one. Let's go. So now we've had our reins downstairs. We're getting a big leg session. We've got 180 on here. It's 220s, 215s and 10. We're going to hit this hard. And the beautiful thing is, you know, gym gear. Doesn't matter when you're here. I mean, I think this is this is the best way to train now. So let's go, nice and focused. Ooh. Huh. Baby, easy. Uh, ooh, ooh. Easy, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Beautiful. Come on. Come on. Uh, woo. Oh, it's all about that. Oh. Mm. Now, put the rest of the leg there. So as amazing as it is having a home gym, weights just feel heavier here. Still, I'm loving having limited equipment and just having to improvise. You do more different stuff that you never would do if you were in a gym, you just go to the machines. But now you have to be creative, working a lot more on core stability, unilateral movements. Like for example, pistol squat, one leg squat. Becoming really good at those when I, when I started struggle to get like five but now I can easily do them once you find your balance and the rhythm you just become really good like press ups my god all the variations so as bad as this thing is always try to look at the positive of things because you know if you don't come out of this with an extra skill you're just lacking the motivation because Honestly, if you have some time to invest into different movements or different things, which you have now, you're going to come out stronger and that goes for everything. <sighs> We're going to continue with this session and uh, I'll see you a little bit later. Just another lunges into 
Ah, go, let's go, let's mount. And that is our workout of the day done. We're gonna chill out now, maybe get something post workout, and then get to work on some edits. It's a good day. So we've showered, and we are just uh, getting some content now. So this is like the post lunch thing we do. Um, with our new camera, look at it, look at it. What do you think so far? Well, she hasn't actually used it. I've used it to get some photos of her. Um, but yeah, we're gonna do some workouts for Instagram and uh, then probably get like two or three, then we will... Um... Yeah, they're using a chainsaw. Chainsaw? Yeah. People across us are doing some home improvement. But yeah, we will, uh, I'll get to editing and more admin stuff, but I'll show you uh, what we do after this. Do you an example? Yeah. This is a great camera, and this is this one. Why is it so dark? Why is it so dark? Hello. 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 I know it's got backlights, but come on, you should be able to do more than that. Oh, there you go. There you go. My bathroom fixed it. There you go. The answer to dark light is bathrobes. All right, guys. Getting into the later part of the day, we have filmed some videos for Instagram and now I'm just going to edit them um, and get it up because I you know, I do the home workout routines. Um, that will probably take a while because we still don't have internet in our house so um, it literally takes like 45 minutes to upload anything because we're not in a very good like 4G spot. Um, and yeah so I'm going to do this now and then we'll probably chill out for a bit and then it's going to be time for dinner. All right guys, so we uh, are downstairs. We have posted, took this time 35 minutes, so not too bad. Um, starting to flag a little bit, pretty tired, but it's uh, currently 6, 10, half six, and we are hungry, so we're gonna make some dinner now. And then I think after that, once we've done all our emails, we've done all our admin, we just sit back and we watch, uh, we watch some TV, but let's, uh, let's see what's for dinner. Right, so unfortunately while I'm cooking, I always snack. Um, and Domi created this amazing pantry. You can see all of my protein goodies here. Um, it's not as neat as it could be, but what? why is there a necklace here? Oh, by the way, we got sent a kilo of uh, pick and mix and it was gone in two days. Yep, and that's pretty much our life at the moment, but these, these are the snack of choice at the moment, like pre-dinner snacks. I always like to snack on something while I eat. To, oh, and it always forgets that I'm inside. But anyway, let's uh, let's let's see what's on the menu. So we ended up going with pizza. So this is actually my first dinner. I'm gonna have another dinner later on uh, because I kept to my carbs and fat breakfast. I uh, got a lot of carbs and a lot of food to play around with because I didn't actually eat much uh, after we filmed and everything like that. So got some pizzas there in the oven. I've got uh, to add some extra protein for Domi. I got her a vegetarian. Burger, these are from Tesco, it's actually really nice. Um, and yeah, we're gonna sit back, watch some money heist. And if you have been watching it, does, is it just me or does do, do you hate Otoro? Uh, is that his name? Or Otoro? Arturo. Otoro. Arturito. 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 We just hate him. I just can't roll my R's. But Arturito. I just can't do it. Anyway, we're gonna cook this and uh, watch a bit of the pizza. Mine doesn't look that good. This is like a starter. Domi's looks That's great. Amazing. And we have the money heist. Still <laughs> haven't got the internet, so no TV. So yeah, we're gonna enjoy this. <laughs> what you doing, babe? Huh? What you doing? I uh, just made dinner number two, so. We haven't moved, and uh, we've just been sitting on there. Do you want to explain your hair real quick? Oh, 
I'm like, yeah, that's you. Don't lose play with my hair while we're watching the movie. <laughs> and as you can see, <laughs> You're out. beautiful. Hey. You're very handsome. <laughs> um, but yeah, we just got into a few episodes of the Money Heist and we couldn't really stop. That just tends to happen quite more often than not. Uh, but you know, we've done all our tasks in the day, we were very productive in the morning, uh, did all our work, so you know, it's nice to rest in the evening. So I'm just going to finish this chicken mince, put some broccoli in the microwave. And I'll show you what I make. <laughs> ah! I spun it and it just hit me. <laughs> the raw chicken just hit me in the face. Brilliant. Last meal of the day, we got some chicken mince, tomatoes, and some broccoli. So we're going to eat this, watch a few more episodes of uh, Money Heist because we are addicted i hate the i hate the show but i'm addicted um and yeah we're gonna get ready for the end of the day and it's the next day don't worry guys i'm still wearing the uh hat of bad hair prevention um but after we finished that meal um we just went to bed uh we watched one more episode getting pretty intense in the money heist but yeah we just went to bed and it is the next day and we're just doing something very similar but um, but yeah, things that we do to stay productive, you know, we plan out our day, we tick things off and I think it's been really good, you know, it's quarantine, you've got to look at the most, you've got to make the most out of the situations that life throws at you and, um, you know, we've managed to focus a lot on our work, especially when it comes to content um, and I'm releasing two new guides, uh, a dumbbell only and a resistance band only on my website, If you so go check them out, uh, they're releasing on May the 6th. Uh, at 3 p.m. GMT. Uh, so yeah, we've done lots of work on that. Uh, we've got a lot of projects coming up. So just staying productive, making sure that we've got a structured plan, we're ticking things off in the day. Um, and it's such a simple thing, but it will guarantee you such a better like day. As in, when you finish the day, you know you've done your tasks, you just feel great and I can't recommend that enough and trust me, it will help you with a lot of things, especially during this quarantine and you can't go out. But anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you're all staying safe. If you haven't liked the video already, please like it um, and subscribe uh, as it means a lot. And if anything, I'll see you in the next one. Take care.